And now the seventh question that is related to global education monitoring report. What is all about the global education monitoring report? We can also expect questions on this global survey or global report on the social sector. So, report formally known as education for all global monitoring report. Then it is an independent and authoritative and evidence based annual report published by UNESCO. So, we can expect questions like who is publishing this global education monitor reports. So, we know that it is an independent and authoritative and evidence based annual report published by the UNESCO. So, the who is publishing it? So, it is published by the UNESCO. So, to monitor, so the purpose here it means the purpose of this monitor report. So, it is aims to monitor the progress towards education which is mentioned in our system development goal. So, it aims to monitor the progress towards education which is mentioned which is a framework under the system development goals that was to uh, that is to achieve by 2030. Now, the 7th question that was related to global education monitoring report. So, before we discuss we would should know what is all about this report. We can also expect questions on this global or international surveys or report related to social sector. So, what is all about global education monitor report? So, this is a report which was formerly known as education for all global monitor report and this is an independent and authoritative and evidence based annual or evidence based annual report published by the UNESCO. So, we can expect who is publishing it. So, either the World Economic Forum or any other institutions. So, we can expect those kind of questions. So, we should know that this global education monitor report is published by the UNESCO. Then what is the purpose of this survey? It aims to monitor the progress towards the education target which is a framework in our sustained development goal to achieve quality education both in primary and the secondary. So, that is why this survey is very important it aims to monitor the progress towards the education. The global education monitor report of 2017 and 18 which expressed some concerns over the school textbook in many countries and which glorifying the war and military heroes rather than teaching the peace or non-violence and reconciliation that can affect they are called not only the quality of education that can affect the development of the children development of this uh, uh, school students. So, it is actually deteriorating the purpose of giving education to the students. So, that is also founded by the report of 2017 and 18. It is also uh, talked about Indian education that India is far ahead to reach the target of sustained development that is such a quality education in the both primary and secondary education. And 2017-18 of the report is titled as accountability in education meetings our commitment. So, these are the major features or point we must remember with regard to global education monitor report. Now, we will discuss about the question. So, the question was with reference to global education monitor report which of the following statement is correct? This is a two statement type questions. If we go through the first statement, it is an editorially independent authoritative and evidence based annual report to monitor progress towards education target in the sustained development goal framework. Yes, this, this statement is correct because we know that this global education monitoring is an independent an evidence based an authoritative annual report that to monitor the progress towards the education which is mentioned in the STG. So, the first statement is correct. So, if first statement is correct we can eliminate option B and D because which is not mentioned the correct statement 1. Then second statement the report is published by the world economic forum. I already mentioned we can we can expect questions like who is publishing it. So, here also they uh, wrongly mentioned who is publishing it. So, here the wrong statement which is mentioned the world economic forum. We know that this report is published by the UNESCO and they are the independent and the authoritative and evidence based they are conducting this evidence based annual report on the progress towards education which is in the sustainable development code. So, second statement is wrong. So, the answer is option A one only. 